I'm building a rocket, I'm going in for elbow, it's their beer, it looks glorious. I've got high hopes though, you know, good musicians, but how are they making beer? I can't obviously open a bottle of beer, I've had far too much wine in my life. Oh, that's an encouraging sound, there's bubbles. Come on you. First of all, this is very exciting. I'm a massive fan of the magazine. So first things first, you know, it's pouring a drink and saying, cheers. Right, that looks pretty good, I have to say. Nice big head, we always like a bit of that. No titters. Uh, let's have a little smell. It smells like beer. Oh, that's a pretty glorious beverage. Elbow, you've scored. Quite a nice bit of richness there, but not too heavy. Do you know what I almost think? If you're a fan of lager, you could almost chill this down, sit back, get a night in front of the telly, watch The Sopranos, and be very happy with a pint of that. Well done, Elbow. Bravo! Joe Elliott of Def Leppard, down and out. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, I'm not sure about the label. Sorry, Joe. I mean, you know... Can you hold it up? Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm... I, I get the kind of the keyboards and the... Mm, and the big star and the guitar heads. And I guess... It's down and 100% roof, 100% proof, genuine rock and roll, volume one. Oh, right, nicely presented. Well, Joe's beer looks like the money. Looks absolutely clear as a bell. Smells pretty good. Nice and hoppy, nice and tangy, nice and bright. That's not half bad. Got quite a hoppy kick to it. That's got a nice intense flavour, good balance between sort of zing and spank with the hops. Good finish on that, yeah. Do you know what? I'm not mad about the label, I'll be completely honest, but the beer itself ain't half bad. If you're a fan of crisp, bright lagers, you could do a lot worse than that. Um, I'm learning everything, everything in my life from ACDC. Um, I absolutely love them, I have to say, so it's one of Australia, obviously. Alright, so far so good. What is that? Colour is ominous. Why is it fizzing? It might just be bottled under a bit of carbon dioxide. Let's have a little thing. Is it going to spritz? Yes, there you go. Slight fizz. Right, they say a sweeter style, low alcohol Moscato. Okay, that's interesting. Perfect for lady rock fans. Mm. A slight fizz finish with peach, pear and apple flavours that are so good, you won't hesitate to belt out, you shook me all night long. Well, okay, we've got to put that to the test. This is a potion that, according to the label, will make me belt out, you shook me all night long, although I have to be a lady rock fan for that really to work. Well, imagine. It smells like Moscato. It smells nice and fruity. Moscato, I know this sounds a bit weird, but it does smell and taste a bit grapey. Oh, it's not very really helpful, I know, but it does. She was a sex machine, she kept the motor clean, she was the best damn woman that I've ever seen. Um, yeah, I'm not really belting it out. It's not bad. But for me, I'll be honest, I'm not a big fan of sweeter wines. But Moscato like this, if you like grapey flavours, fine for a summer's day and a picnic. When you're evaluating... Oh, what's this doing here? No, way. Right, when you're evaluating a wine, pour a little bit in. Have a look at the colour. Mm, it's red. Okay, that actually smells okay. I'm, I'm happy with that. So, they've scored. They're definitely rocking me. This is so far not a highway to hell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's not bad. It's very fruity. I could see that glugging at a barbecue at a rock gig. That, I could imagine, possibly Angus swinging backstage. Yeah, I think that could plug him in. Give him some power. Give him some oomph. Really get him going wiggly wiggly wee. So anyway. Right. Let's go in. Right, here we go. Shiraz from Australia. Motorhead. It's a bit of an odd feeling to be drinking the essence of Motorhead. I hope they've filtered it. it. Smells like Shiraz. A little bit spicy. Quite dark. Pleasing. I would say, with a Chari steak, Motorhead Shiraz. Quite happily drink that. So far, I think Motorhead are leading in the wine rock stakes.
didn't expect that. And I'm sure Motorhead didn't either. Lemmy, here's to us. <laughs>